Yes, what's everyone saying? Welcome back. Okay, pardon me for the throat being a bit uh, rough this morning and for me being a bit whew, hot and sticky. I've just been doing some drainage work with some chemicals and whatnot. And I'm drained. <laughs> no pun intended. All right, um, Danny lad. Danny Christian of the world um, was doing some sparring um, yesterday on one of his videos with, um, was it a Matthew or a Mickey or something or other. Um, and I've got to say, and this... This will surprise a lot of people, but credit where credit's due, that was pretty polished. That was, there was some good punching power, there was some decent skill. Uh, as everybody knows, I'm an ex-pro uh, myself, yeah? I had 95 fights, 95 wins, all 95 by big KO. That was when I was in my prime, obviously. I'm long since retired, but I will be doing self-defense classes either tomorrow or Friday. Don't worry, they are still coming. Nothing's being cancelled here on this channel, mate. All right. But, yeah, really good stuff. Really good um, punching power. But, but, I did notice a few little, um, how can we put it? Problems. Some problems with his footwork. He was far too stiff, far too flat-footed. He was... It was like Herman Munster, you know, like like that, you know. And he was too, like, like he was about to fall forward. Like he was about to, I don't know, you know, I believe I could fly or something like that. You know, well, I bet he's, but he's got a lot in common with R. Kelly and he's our Danny lad. <laughs> but um, no, it was too much like that, too much like that. Legs were too stiff, you know. There was no, no, no hip movement, no head movement. What have I told him? The head, the head. Use your toes, man. Use your toes like this, like this. Ready, keep, keep, always keep your left just below your chin, ready to throw that big overhand right. Do you know what I mean? You know, kind of move a bit, move. Let's see some movement, you know what I mean? Let's see some movement like that, you know, and then bam, bam, bam. You know, a few, you know, that's this. You know, let, let the hands go, you know. Pardon me. Now, I can't show you properly right now because the self-defense lessons are coming and I want to really educate most, pe most people on this side of YouTube. Haven't got a fight in them. Unfortunately, they're not from our world, you know. We're ex-gangster, ex-gang leader, ex-gang member, ex-enforcer, ex-debt collector, ex-fighter, um, businessman extraordinaire, you know what I mean, uh, just some of my accomplishments over the last 20 years in life that's built me to the most successful man I am today, but apart from that, it was just flat, it was very zombie-like, zombie-like, and then, you know, it was uh, too much of that, too much of that, no, not enough of that, mate, not enough of that, and then, let them go. Let the hands go. Don't be afraid to let them go. Don't just cover up, you know, and, you know, hoping the other guy's going to punch himself out. That's not the way to... Use your toes, man, and throw from the hip. Throw from the hip. Hip. Shoulders. Lateral. La lateral punches. Let's see them. But, um, all in all, credit where credit's due. Um, he's a trier, isn't he, Danny lad? We <laughs> He's trying in a lot of ways, but that's another story. Um, but yeah, that's it. Anyway, people, I've got to get back. Whew, the weather's killing me, and I'm still doing all that drainage, so I've got to get back to all the um, drainage. Um, dismantle all the pipes, and then uh, move it from the northern section uh, to the south, south section, and um, connect all the pipes so they're all going from that way to that way, and it's all, it's all very technical, it's all technical jargon, I can't really get into it with all you people, because you probably won't know what I'm talking about, but have a blessed day, and I'll speak to you later on, take care.